to a acceleration for a particle moving along a straight line t second after passing through a fixed point O is given by so we have acceleration so you see here after passing fixed point O okay you see here this equation after passing point O so we know that when t is equal to 0 s is equal to 0 so a is this one given the velocity of particle t is equal to 1 second after passing this one is me okay so it's given that t is equal to 1 v is equal to negative 10 meter per second find instantaneous displacement of the particle when okay now we need to know what is our formula for displacement so here we know that we have this one is displacement to get velocity to get acceleration so you cannot get you cannot get uh, displacement without velocity so it must go one by one so we know that as to displacement to velocity this one is ds over dt v to a this one is dv over dt so going the other way around to get v from a this one is integration this one is integration so what we have here is a right so a is equal to 12t minus a so to find equation of displacement we must find v first so here v is equal to integration of a dt because in term of t so a is 12t minus 8 dt so here when we integrate 12t we get 12 so t is actually power of 1 we add the power with 1 t 2 divided by 2 minus so this one 8 become 8t don't forget to plus c because this one is indefinite integral that means you don't have range from here to here okay so here this one is 60 square minus 80 plus 6. So we cannot, so we want to find this place where, right? So, but we cannot have C here. So we see back from the question, what do they give? So we see here we have this one when T is equal to 1, V is equal to negative 10. So if we substitute our V and T, we can get what is our C. So here when v is equal to negative 10, negative 10 is equal to 60 is equal to 1, right? This one is 1 square minus 8, 1 plus c. So negative 10 is equal to 6 minus 8 plus c. Negative 10 is equal to negative 2 plus c. So c is equal to, so negative 2 when you change to the left, it becomes positive 2. So here we get negative 8. So now when you have your c, you know that your v is equal to so up here my formula is 6t square minus 8t c is minus 8 okay now you are not yet now only you can find what is your s s is the integration of v dt so v is 6t square minus 8t minus 8 dt so when you integrate 60 square, you get 60 cubed divided by 3 minus 8t square divided by 2. Right, this one is 1, you add the power is 1 divided with it, minus 8t and plus c. So 60 divided by 3, we get 2, 3 cubed minus 4t square minus 8t plus c. So we know that this one is calculated after passing through O. Passing through O, this one s is equal to 0, t is equal to 0. So, S is equal to 0, T is equal to 0. So, when we substitute, we get that C is equal to 0 because this one is 0, this one we get 0, right? Because anything multiplied with 0 is 0, this one is 0, this one is 0, plus C, C is 0. So, here we get our S. So, where to write? So, up here, S is equal to 2T cubed minus 4T square minus 8T. Because our C is 0. So now, after we know the equation of displacement, then only we can start doing our equation. So acceleration is 4 meter per second square. So we have equation of A. A is equal to 12T minus 8. Right? So when A is equal to 4, this one is 12T minus 8. So we bring at one side. So negative 8 become positive 8. 4 plus 8 is equal to 12t. So this one is 12t is equal to 12. 
t is equal to 1. So, when acceleration is 4 meter per second, time is equal to 1. So, at time is equal to 1, we can know what is our displacement because we have equation. So, s is equal to 2t cube minus 4t square minus 8t. So, when t is equal to 1, S is equal to 2, 1 cube minus 4, 1 square minus 8, 1. So, 2 minus 4 minus 8. So, this one is negative 2 minus 8. You get negative 10 meter. So, this one is displacement. So, negative uh, means that this one is on the left. Negative 10 meter to the left of O. So, B, particle is at rest. What happened when at rest? At rest, that means it's not moving. Or oh, V is equal to 0. So, we must find the time when V is equal to 0. So, when V is equal to 0, we have equation of V, right? Which is 60 square minus 80 minus 8. So, we make it equal to 0. This one we can divide with 3, with 2, right? So, we get 3T square minus 4T minus 4 is equal to 0. Then, here we can do factorization. So, here you get 3t plus 2 and here we get t minus 2. So, here t is equal to negative 3, 2, 2 over 3. This one is t is equal to 2. But we know that our time cannot be negative. This one is not acceptable. t is equal to 2. So, we know particle is at rest when at 2 second. But the question 1 displacement. So, what is the displacement when at 2 second? So, when t is equal to 2, displacement is equal to 2. So, just uh, put the formula of displacement. Just change t to 2. This one is 2 cube minus 4, 2 square minus 8, 2. So, this one is 2 times 8 minus 4 times 4 is 16 minus 16. So, this one is 16 minus 32. This one is basically negative 16 meter.